Hello everybody out there in YouTube land. This is Good Times for All or Zachary Zabala if you prefer. Now what you're looking at here are the marks that electrical discharges make in a loose surface. What I have here is some baby powder and a lid. A metallic paint can lid setting on top of the Van de Graaff generator. I also have let me discharge that. I'm going to get rid of all of these and smooth this back out. Okay. Give me one sec to dump this. This is just baby powder. Really don't like playing with this stuff because I know it's really not that good for you to be around. But we make uh, sacrifices in the name of science, right? So we have our powder there. We'll take one more close look at it. quick so you can see that there are no more holes in it like we had now I don't have enough power to make the big looking craters I've been thinking about this a lot like the craters on that we find here on earth the craters on the moon things like that now what we're gonna get is um since this is the positive and this is the negative, some of this is going to come up to the positive right away and make some weird patterns on the top right away, kind of like pitting. Now we don't have enough power to get a nice charge to clear out all the powder all the way down to the hard surface, but um, we do see some really neat things. So let's go ahead and fire this up and get some... There's that beginning... You can see the powder, how it's, it's like jumping up almost. I'm looking for a nice good discharge here. Come on. We've had a couple small guys. There was an all right one. We're getting a lot of discharging through noise. There we go. Okay, so we've made some electrical discharges. Now what we get, when we take a closer look at this, remember how it was smooth just a little bit ago? Look at that. that kind of remind you of anything? And remember, we don't have enough power to get any real big electrical discharges. But if I had the coloring right and this and that and some more power, I bet I could make this look in a way that I could fool people and say that I had a lunar something or other up there orbiting the moon sending back pictures and people would believe it but that's it I thought that was pretty neat 
Um, I'm going to try to get some more power and see if I can't really make some neat craters. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you. Making craters just like we see on the moon with electricity. So this is Good Times for All signing out. As always, thanks for watching.